Hey guys, it's your girl Coco. Welcome back to my channel. And on this channel, we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and styling, guys. So you guys may have seen this jacket already because I did another video. <laughs> but I wanted to give you guys a quick update on my Spark al aligners. I am on week four out of my 13 trays. And the reason why I wanted to do this video today is because tray four is tight, okay? <laughs> it's not unbearable tight, but I feel that they're shifting. And I think I've said this probably one or two times. Um, I changed my trays at nighttime to lessen the pain. Uh, so, but, so, so today is like the first full day of me wearing them because I changed them last night. And it's tight today, okay? <laughs> I'm gonna come closer and let you guys see the progress. See? Remember I had some spacing here? I have the, them on now. I had some spacing here when I smiled. Um, and down here. So, I think they look really good. <laughs> so, Again, that is week four. I am, I have six more trays that are actual trays for shifting. The additional three are going to be my retainers. I still have not gotten a chance to speak to them about the retainers and how the additional retainers that I may have to purchase. Um, but this is just a quick little update on the aligners, guys. If you are interested in them, make sure you're going to an orthodontist. I'm probably going to say this a million times in all my videos. Price-wise and experience-wise, I would say go to an orthodontist. After you go to your orthodontist and they take off everything, I would recommend getting your teeth whitened at your regular dentist. <laughs> um, and getting, you know, getting all that grit and stuff off your teeth. But this is just a quick little video about my week four or my second set of aligners. Guys, listen. Invisalign and Spark Aligner are the same process like every other aligners that are out there. However, these are lighter in color, that they're clearer. And I haven't had any issues. Like I said, I've heard women say they had a struggle like with their liners, like pain. And I do change mine every week, which I love <laughs> because, listen, these things can get dirty. You may think you're cleaning your teeth really, really good, and then you miss a spot or something like that, and then you take them out, and then you see something, and it's like gross. So make sure you are flossing, you are doing mouthwash, and then you're brushing your teeth, your tongue, all that good stuff. I know you guys know this, but <laughs> some people don't brush their tongues guys okay so quick video i just wanted to give you guys an update for those of you guys who are following my pro pro progress on my spark aligners and if you are interested in them i 100 percent do recommend them i am not they're not sponsoring this video but my experience no real pain no cuts none of that I will recommend them. One more thing, I'm gonna show you guys. I don't know if I ever showed you guys this, but the top of the aligner, it comes all the way up. And apparently, they say that the Invisalign, more of your teeth are showing. So, I guess that's another reason why my orthodontist chose to switch over to Spark Aligner. Now, he might be getting some money. <laughs> I don't know, he might be. but. I definitely recommend them guys. No cuts, no gum issues, um, knock on wood. <laughs> I haven't had any of that happen, so this is why I would recommend it. I'm not gonna recommend something that I don't like. You guys already know how I am with certain things. I am going to be honest. If I don't like something, I'm going to say it. And sometimes I'm lazy and I won't send something back, but I, I've gotten better with that. But um, yeah, so this is week four out of my new set of 13 trays and the 10 were actual aligners guys so that is it guys let me know if you want to continue following my journey and if you have any other questions about it i do get questions in the comment box and i'm excited that you guys are actually doing it listen your teeth are important some people are not comfortable with smiling because of their teeth and it just takes a little bit of investment guys 
if your orthodontist does have a payment plan, do that then, okay? Most of the time, it's no interest, which is perfect. So you can just pay on it at your time, um, at your pace, and then be done with it. So I think mine were like 4000 but my insurance covered like two, twenty something something like that. So it was only half that I really had to pay. So that's why I said go to an orthodontist. It'll most likely be cheaper than going to your regular dentist. And the experience is completely different. So... Anyway, guys, if you like videos like this, please comment below. Make sure you are subscribing to this channel. My numbers are going up. I'm excited. I know that I have a lot of stuff that I really want to do for you guys. Just bear with me. I'm trying to get into the routine of stuff. Like, really, to be honest. Like, I have a lot of videos, but I'm still, like, trying to get there. And, you know, and make you guys interested in what I have to say. So, make sure you follow me on Instagram, my Coco Styles, and Coco Styles NYC and Coco Styles NY and my blog, Coco Styles NYC. That blog is a style blog. I have tips and tricks for everything for you ladies. Um, and my personal style and services at CocoStylesNY.com, guys. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.